That's pretty cool. And uh, Jen's setting up behind me, so I'm gonna let her get on with it and uh, keep out of the way. Which is a good excuse for letting her do work that she likes to do, but also means I can run off and take some pictures of things before people get in. Costume. Oh yeah. Now, if, if that doesn't win the um, cosplay costume event, then it's going to be some really good costumes down there because that is one of the best attention to detail I've seen. <laughs> Fantastic. My goodness, The Sims and a couple of very cute Poké Hunters. Hello there. Misty! Ah. Okay. I don't know things. I don't know. Are you going to catch them all? Catch them all. Two horses from you. Are you doing film or photo? Film. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> I thought you were doing a photo. No, I've already done the photo. She's got so many films of me with a manic smile. Have you heard of her? Have you heard of her? She's very good. She's very good to know. Yeah. Next. Hi, I'm Zoe Kerr Robinson. I invented the first webcomic from Britain and I'm um, here to tell you why you should make comics. So, if there are no rules, well, how do comics work? And when you, when you look at uh, different forms, we've got like, three panels, or we can have full screen, a, a Japanese style, uh, or a long form comic like a comic book. So, basically, if you want to make comics, they work any way that you want them to. If you're doing an infinite scroll, they're going to see the next part of what you've just uh, put in, and it kind of spoils the cliffhanger. So it changes how you would lay out the comic and uh, what you can essentially say with it as you go along. And essentially, I've run through it very quickly because I know that the sword fighting is coming up. So that's why you should make comics, and thank you very much. Have you seen the original PS2 demonstration play a game of beer cabinet that's just studded in there? No. Let's go and have a look. Look at that. Look at the quality of it. Still in its nice stand. 
And the controllers have been used clearly, but still in pretty good condition. Still got its original stand. Looks very cool. So we're still here at KingCon, and uh, the talk went really well, even though it was about an hour late. She was the guy who played Admiral Akbar in uh, Star Wars, uh, talking all well over his time. It was touch and go whether I was actually going to have uh, the ability to do the talk, but thankfully the Astronomy Society got sick of waiting and, and left, so I took the spot. So that's pretty good. But uh, we've just seen this original PlayStation 2, and my goodness, look at this. It's even got a working PlayStation in it. I wish it was turned on because I would uh, actually be sitting here playing, playing a game. I, I'm assuming it's going to be a football game or something that's in there, but nice to see. I mean, you don't see them in this quality. Well, not usually these days. So yeah, very cool. Are you going to catch them all? Pokeball, <laughs> <laughs> that's it. My goodness, someone is late for a very important date. Yeah. Right, I really like it. Walk there. Oh my goodness.